Hey y'all, it's Taylor from Tattoo Teacher Plans. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a plan with me and we're gonna be using this really pretty kit from Simply Ginger Co. It was sent to me by the owner, Melissa, and I love it. And I'm not just saying that because she sent it to me. I love this. I already have my eye on it actually before she reached out and I adore this. So let me show you the kit and then we will get started. So this is called Secret Garden. And it has this really pretty navy, like, black-blue um, background in most everything. Um, and then the sagey green. It's really pretty. So here are the full boxes. Choose to be happy. I love that quote. And these arrows, or they remind me of arrows. I love that pattern. And then we have the clipboard checklists, which I love the clipboards. They're so cute. And then this is the first functional sheet with some icons, flags, habit trackers, bill dues, lots of quarter boxes and appointment labels, which I love. My kids never have enough of those. And then we have eight half boxes, a couple more quarters, some functional deco, which matches perfectly, which is super cute. Some checklists, um, some little hearts and asterisks and stars, and then the weekend banner. And then we have the headers and little things. And then the bottom washi, which I've already cut, you can see. But the big flowers are so pretty. Um, I cut this because I'm going to be using the smaller strip up on the top and the bigger strip on the bottom. I did that last week and I really liked it, so we're going to do that again. So, I'm also going to be using these from Wild Summer Designs. These are called the Neutral Highlighters, which I would call these markers. But I'm going to be using the blue and then this dark sagey green. So, there's that for my school headers. And... I think we are ready to get started. So I'm going to do the bottom washi, the top washi, the weekend banner, um, the flags, and put in my school headers, and I will see you in a minute. Okay, we are ready to work on the sidebar. I am loving these colors. These green and the blue, oh, it's so pretty. Okay, so we're obviously gonna use the quote box for the sidebar, the choose to be happy because I love it. That is something I have to remind myself often um let's see okay i want to use one of these if i have room for it and then i need two habit trackers i've been doing a no spend lately which is going really well actually it's not like i'm not spending any money i'm just being very very conscious of what i am buying okay and then i want to do a cleaning list down here as usual so i'm going to do to clean Ooh, or maybe I'll do this week. Yeah, let's do that. And then I want to use like a the sagey green for my to-do list. Okay, let's see how much room we have. I thought about maybe some washi. Hold on. I've been kind of enjoying that in the sidebar. So let me do use this piece right here. And I'm going to pop this in the middle. Like that. Is that straight? Kind of. 
Okay, and then I don't know that I have room. Let's see. Yeah, yeah, I do. If I don't put any washi behind the habit trackers like I have been doing. I don't know that I need this much space, but let's see. Move a little bit of white space in between these guys. Just a little sliver of breeding room. Ooh, that's going to be tight. Hmm. I don't need this. I guess it doesn't need a header. I mean, that's obviously like to do's. Yeah, let's just leave it like that. That's pretty. Okay. And then I think we're done with that. We're ready for the day by day. Okay, so let me zoom in just a little bit. If I do more than that, I get out of frame, as y'all know. Okay, let me pick something to go over here in this corner. I feel like maybe this one, because this is like a complete box. I really like her matte paper. It's really, really nice. It's not too thick, but not too thin. It's like saturated too, so I like that a lot. Okay, now let's go to the day by day. Okay, this day I do not have any appointments, which is awesome, except we do have something important. So I'm gonna take a, I don't think I need a half box for that. Let me just do maybe a quarter box would be good. Okay, let's do this one. Yeah. We have a deadline this day, which I'm kind of like responsible for making sure everyone gets there. I'll put the little clock. Okay. And then these will just go in a to-do list. Oh, I do kind of want to mark that this is the first day of the second six weeks too. Um, maybe another half box. Ooh, I could use an appointment label. Let me use this sagey green one. And then maybe an icon. This little navy one, little asterisk. Yes, that will work. Okay, and then I don't have anything else this day besides these things. And then down here at the bottom, I need to do a couple of things. Okay, I have these. Let me find some stickers real quick. Okay, I have these from Nikki Plus 3 and they just say change air filter. So do I have a color that kind of goes? Maybe just a gray. This green is a little bright. Or the, let me use the black. No, gray. Okay, so I need that, and then I need a probably a quarter box. There's plenty in this kit, thank goodness. Okay, let me use this. I don't know about flower being on flower. Let me use the navy one here for my video, and I don't know what I want to use with that. Maybe a little heart. I don't want to bring any foil in this week. I'm going to keep it kind of simple. Yeah, that's pretty. Okay, and then I'll just put the little air filter, change air filter right here. And then I'll put a little box next to it. Okay. And then on to Tuesday. Okay, I have two appointments. Okay, let me do a solid and a flower. Here and here. There we go. Okay, so one of them is like a meeting. Well, they're both meetings, but 
Mm. Okay, I'll come back to that in a little bit. Yeah, I'll come back to that. Okay, and then Wednesday, I have a meeting that day as well. Let me use an appointment label just to mix it up. What is this light blue one? These peel up so nice from the paper. Like from the sticker paper. Okay, so there. Mm. Okay, we're just gonna leave that one too. I'll figure out something to mark that with. And then my cleaning list. So I'm gonna use the two clean header and maybe a checklist. I think that'll be cute. Let's see if they line up with the lines at all. Close enough for three. I just got these new scissors from Amazon. These are uh, the Scotch Titanium Nonstick. These are bad ass. I didn't know what I was missing with my other stickers until I got these and these are amazing. Not only are they sharp, but nothing sticks to them. It's amazing. So I cut up my stickers a lot and it's hard to find stickers or scissors that won't get all sticky. And I kept having to buy new stickers and I thought that was dumb. So I found those and they're so good. Okay, I think I wanna kind of add a little something. Maybe this little, yeah, little stripe spray bottle. That's cute. All right, and then I think we're good. This week is super boring. <sighs> okay, so I want to do another of these little clipboards for my high five for Friday list. These are the five best things from the week. And then I thought I might use just like a little thing on top of it as like a header. Um, what color? I feel like the sagey green. Let me use this one. On top of it like that. And then I'll find something to cover up that little envelope, maybe a little coffee cup, it's cute, that's cute, okay, so back to Thursday, I don't know why I just jumped in and did that, okay, Thursday, I have a meeting, as usual, so, I don't know why that's on there, that's old, okay, let me use like this sagey green flag just to kind of mix up like my appointments and stuff. Oh, it's like a tight fit though. Okay, forget that. Mm. The struggle of the hourly is you're like tied to the lines, like you don't have to be, but you are because you're OCD and you must fit everything to the lines for some weird reason. Okay, let's do... Let's just do a half box. No, quarter box. That's what I meant. Okay, we'll do this. And then this day, I don't have anything going on besides these two things. Here, let's do some Saturday to-dos. I kind of want to use... Hmm. Do I want to use one of these? I don't know that I have enough things... Let's just do it. It's fine. I'll just put some things in here that I would normally separate out. Let me do a to-do header. Okay, let's do... Let's do the sagey green. Not straight or centered. It's 
also the other thing about the hourly. Do you align left or right or center? I always do center, but then you can never find the true center. I don't know. Whatever. Okay, then let's see. We need a... Um, I don't want to do to do. Let's do it today. But like a checklist. I love this green color. It's really pretty. Let me do this color though. So I haven't used very much of that. And a to do header, navy to do down here for like my filming stuff. I always do three for my filming stuff. I don't know why. I just do. Probably so I don't get booked with too many things to film. Okay. And then this is going to go on top. Like that. Okay. There's that. And then... Sunday. Let's do a navy little checklist here for my prayers. Not a checklist, just a little thing. And then I'll just do a, a little bulleted list for that. Come on. There we go. Okay. Now, now what? Is that all? This week is so boring. Oh, I did bring out this. These are from Bubba Air Studio. And I think they're so cute. And I want to incorporate one of them. But I don't know which one. Hmm. Maybe just like... No, I'm not going to use that. Indecision. Okay. I think we're good. I think I'm ready to fill in. I'm sure there's other things that I'm like missing. Oh, my video. What did I do over here? Okay. We're going to do quarter box. Nope. And a solid quarter box. And a little heart. Which one? I'm gonna use the light blue. There we go. Okay, let's see what we got. Oh, this is so pretty. Here, let me zoom you out. Okay, I'm going to fill this in right now. And then um, I'll be back to show you the pre-planning. Sorry for the boringness. Okay.
my pre-planing done. I'm loving how this is turning out. It's really, really pretty. One thing I did add, well, I added a couple things. I went ahead and put in some different things for, no, I didn't. I just figured it out over here. I did add in this little TV little thing for Criminal Minds. I do watch more TV than that, obviously. But this is the only show that I watch like on TV because everything else I can get on Hulu. Um, I do want to add in my workouts so that I am motivated by the sticker in my planner. So I love this pattern and I want to use this on Monday. So I have all these half boxes, so that's perfect. Um, let's use this color on Tuesday. And then let's use a patterned one on Wednesday. And a solid, no, let's use a patterned. And how about this one over here? Thursday and then I'll probably do one on Sunday. Let me do this sagey green one over here on Sunday. Okay. Is that all? I think that's all. Yeah, I think so. Okay, so here is my pre-planning all done. Love this kit. Mm, I know it's going to be just super beautiful. So I'll be back in a second to show you the finished spread. Okay, I'm popping on real quick because I found a couple things that I forgot to label when I was filling everything out. So I added that and then I took up this little quarter box that was for an upload because I don't have one. And so I just took that up. But these stickers peel up very nicely. So there's something I learned. All right, now I'm really gonna be back in a second to show you the final spread. So here is my finished spread using Secret Garden. I love how this turned out. It is so pretty. It's neutral, but it still has like the florals and the, the shades of green and blue are perfection. Love it so much. I like my weather doodles too. It kind of brings it all together in my opinion. But this is pretty much it. As usual, it is Saturday, so I have a couple of things to fill in on Sunday and still working on the sidebar, but you get the idea. Let me show you what I have left because I got a lot out of this kit, but there's a lot left. I think I could actually spread this over two weeks easily. So here is the rest of the washi sheet. Here is the functional sheet. I still have some half boxes and quarter boxes, which is insane because that never happens. The checklist. I used almost all of the full boxes. And then some more functional stuff. Another quarter box. Crazy. And then lots of headers and little things left. So, like I said, I think this could definitely be used over two weeks if you're a white space planner. But, yeah, let's look at it a little bit closer. And I'll show you where everything's from. Okay, so over here we have um, pretty much everything from the kit except for my little school headers. These are from uh, Wild Summer Designs. And then I have down here, these are some Happy Planner stickers, these two. And then I just cut out one of the flowers from a washi uh, strip. Um, fitness stickers are from Linda's Planner. And this little change air filter is from Nikki Plus 3. Oh, this water bottle is from an old, old sampler. I tried to color over it with some color pencils to make it match a little better. That didn't really work out so well, but it's all right. Uh, over here, this is all from the kit. This is from an old sheet from uh, Paper and Glam. And then again, lid is planner. And then down here, I think everything is from the kit. Oh, this is a little happy planner stickers right here. Those little tea bags are so cute. And this little shirt, I love that too. So that is it. So one last look at the full spread and I think we're done. So give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe if you're not subscribed and I'll see you next week. Bye.